In this video, we will demonstrate how to export a Silk4j unit test and import into a Silk Performer project for load test executions. First, we will verify that the test runs OK in Silk4j. Select any browser, in this case, I will select Chrome. Let us wait for the test completion. Now that the test is finished and there are no errors, we are ready to export it. So we go to the Package Explorer, right-click the Project Top Level node and select Export. Select Java, Jar File, click Next. In my case, I had exported it before, so I will just click Finish and overwrite the previous version. Now in Silk Performer, Create a new project, select GUI Level Testing, Silk Test, give it a name, click Next, browse to the file exported in Silk4j, select Import Silk4j Test, select the class and the related method. For this case, we will set Firefox as the browser for our load test. Let us give the script a name. For this short test, I will make sure all transactions are completed. Now, select GUI Level Testing to confirm our test will run using Firefox. Verify that other browser options are available. Confirm the selection. I will remove monitoring now for demonstration purposes. Now let's execute the load test. Here I'm configuring an increasing workload with two users for a short period of time. The second VU will start five seconds later. Click Run and confirm the workload folder. Notice the first Firefox window starting. And the second Firefox window starts. As you can see, this is a Silk4j unit test running in parallel under the same user session because it makes use of Silk Test parallel execution and cross browser capabilities. You can even change the script programmatically to use different browsers in the same session. Supported browsers are Chrome, Firefox, and PhantomJS. Our test is nearly finished now. Now we can verify the test was executed successfully. In this video, we have demonstrated that Silk4j test cases can be reused for load test execution in Silk Performer with the supported browsers such as Chrome and Firefox. Mm -hmm.